But generally, I mean, the inside of Mirata has been solid. And look at that, KJ McDaniels adds on to the lead. There's a problem with Rain or Shine yan because so far, it's Big Bo who have to be the rim protector. Dalawang former Letra Knights battling each other out. Oh, At nakisali pa si KJ McDaniels. He's not yet done. Far from it. Certainly a commendable effort for KJ McDaniels. And guess what, coach? Second chance points na naman yan on that putback jam. Post up. Weathers staying in step. Uh oh, that'll count. Make a summon foul. He's now with 11 points this quarter. He had a total of 11 in the first two, 11 here in the third. Norman Black is telling his team, let's use our fouls. We have only three team fouls. Yes, so two fouls to give. I don't know anybody in the right mind who would question that. Hindi, tsaka tama yung sinabi ni Coach Norman, di ba? Malalaki yung mga import eh. Na kalaban ng KJ Magdanos in the previous conference. And I felt that when they brought in KJ Magdanos, they were already pretty much preparing for this conference. Late na. Steal by KJ. Three on two. KJ all the way! KJ is one of those imports that likes to jump with two feet. Look at this. KJ with a steal. It was a three on two break. Nobody really checking him. Alex last line made a business decision there. KJ. When in his first stint in the PBA, he shot 18.2% from beyond the arc. Oh, look at KJ McDaniels. You give him the baseline, and that's what he's going to do. A slap dunk. He wouldn't get uh, that violation uh, called against him. Here's that slam dunk by McDaniels' move of the game early on, presented by Honda, the official motorcycle of the PBA. Don't be surprised if they find ways to get him going in the second half. Talking about KJ, and KJ trying to do so there. KJ McDaniels on the run. Cameron Clark right in front of him, though. KJ McDaniels finding away inside for the slam. Notice the difference in aggressiveness of KJ McDaniels. Earlier, you could see, you know, he'll post up. When he gets that basketball, then maybe he'll try to look for his shot. But that time, going coast to coast off that, from that rebound. They took a lot of open shots. Hindi lang talaga pung pasok. They have to continue taking those shots with confidence and continue to shut down Jumar, gentlemen. Let's take a look at that run again. Running the floor and finishing hard. Libre. Jefferson has already gathered together 27 points. Missing the two free throws. 32 points, however, already. Oh, that's that a nice count. strong drive there. Oh, by the way, Jefferson already has 27, but now uh, McDaniels has 17 in a bonus free throw. 10 point difference. A lot of time here for Maralco. They want to go two for one as well. KJ oh, with yes. the basket and one opportunity by Yo. Adam's a difficult shot. Get his space to operate against that zone defense because he's hemmed in outside. And that time, finding the crease in the defense. Also, try to help out his teammates off the boards. KJ. Oh, no, wala, no, wala. Oh, ho, ho. Hammer time for KJ McDaniels. This time, he went strong to the hole. Ito makita natin ang ginawa ni McDaniels. Boy, that was a man-sized slam dunk. Ito with a one-hander. And then another turnover by Newsom. Oh, I think that's successful. Parang may switch na ito. McDaniels, I don't think, has scored in this quarter yet. There, he's trying to get one. And he finally got it. Wala, eh. Two minutes yun, 13 points. Oh, Dito na sa bubble. Yeah, eh. Well, these two coaches are guys that do not give up. They try to always rally their troops. He's short. KJ sees the baseline. Ang lalim! Oh! What a shot! Wala kay KJ McDaniels! Emergency shot yun ang tawag doon. <laughs> Look at this shot first of all. Tignan mo naman ito. 
Ganda eh, no? Hindi umabot, di kumapit sa backboard, Doc. Eh. Walang pectus involved, pero just got it off. Here's news of beating up three on two. No look pass to the trailer! That was great fast break and teamwork displayed by the Bolts. They knew that McDaniels was trailing. Trailing, down, yeah, and, it was trailing. And the Bolts now lead with their largest advantage in the opening period, a 10 point lead. 40 seconds. Oh, the babalik pa ang bola sa Converge. Naipit, pasok! Here we go. That was quick. They're smiling at us, though, because it presented itself that way. Nakita mo nung si Barkley Ibonya yung nasa harapan niya. Alam ni KJ that he has the strength advantage to get around itong si Barkley Ibonya, not even the help of Kevin Rakal. Muya. Sapal kay McDaniels. Now these two teams are running. And KJ with the rack attack. Did you see that nice shake? Again, one of Maxwell. Now, wala dun si ano, but don't look at this block here by Meralco. The key here, John, is for Meralco to be able to play defense individually. Banquero up against Halalo. Maliksi with a good cut. Hodge can shoot. Here's a foul oh, yes. and a basket Body by control. KJ McDaniels. Great extra pass by Meralco. A personal foul there on. Uh, Abueva. Calvin Abueva. Two. And Two suspending three. himself in midair. Three na si Abueva. Yes, that's three. Attacking Banquero. Everybody has to get out of the three second area. Oh. Oh. Territorio. Wow. I mean, we all know KJ McDaniels is the guy that's, you know, calm, cool, and collected. But he has come out on a different gear as well. 30 seconds remaining. KJ wants wow. this basket and this game. Credit half that basket to Cliff Hodge, who made room for KJ McDaniels. KJ McDaniels attacking, but look at Cliff Hodge boxing out a helper in Rondé Hollis Jefferson so that he couldn't help look at Cliff Hodge. So it was ended up to be Roger Pogoy, and he cannot change the shot of KJ McDaniels. You know, the song playing in the background from Beverly Hills Cop, the late uh, Glenn Fry, the heat is on. 